Okay, hello everyone, and welcome uh, back to World of Tanks Blitz, and this is going to be um, certainly not a game that you'll have seen before. Um, because over Halloween, I know I'm late to the party now, I did manage to get the reviews out of the two Halloween tanks this year, um, but I didn't make a video on the special event that's going on, which is a new um, game mode. Um, but it plays similar to the other game modes where you have, um, for example, last year we had that one where you have all those crazy abilities, such as to make your tank invisible or whatever. This is basically it. Um, except over the course of each um, second, I think it is, you will get, um, you will get, um, so sort of like, I don't know, blood drops or something. Um, and you will, of course, get blood drops as you do damage, etc., etc. You can see them right under, uh, or right above the hearts on the middle left of my screen here. And, uh, yeah, this is a tier 8 battle, as you can see. I am in the Tankenstein, of course. Um, and the Tankenstein has got an ability, number 7, which uh, basically spins the tank in a random direction that you're pointing at. Um, you have to have direct line of sight to it. But... You do have three lives in this game mode, and I will put them to very good effect with my Tankenstein. There you go. Now, I can run premium armor piercing pretty much the entire game, and I do. <laughs> because it does have drawbacks, which is that it has lower penetration, which against tier 8s is not the best. But sideways on, I will pretty much be able to do mass damage to everything. I will basically be a tier 8 heavy tank. Um, in this game with how much damage I'm putting out. So there's an SU-152. Now watch number 7 ability. Well, I will put into ability. I will put into use at some point. In he comes. I put a nice shot into him. Dealt like half his damage. He puts it into my track. I use my um, ability there which as you can see span him round which allowed the AMX to get some good shots on him. Now we've got a Lycan Knight with us. There's also the M41. There's also that tank destroyer right there. However, I switched to regular AP because I know I can't, I don't need to waste the pre uh, regular armor, uh, premium AP on that bulldog. Finish him off. So there's a kill. Now there's a VK over there on low health. There's also a T32. And I can see them both looking at me. So I am planning on just rolling out, shooting <laughs> the VK. Someone spins me around, but it's alright. It helps me get into cover. No one had shots on me, so there you go. Um, so yeah, I only took one shot from the T-32, and so far I've killed two enemy tanks, which uh, I think is not too bad going. Now, I can roll out again, because I'm almost reloaded. And there's that T-32. Uh, premium AP. Bang! 531 compared to his 319. Um, and I've lost barely any of my health, and I get three lives. Someone nukes the T-32. <laughs> Um, and yeah, I've accumulated a lot of this uh, currency for this game and base uh, for this well battle. And basically, when you die, you can choose various abilities that will assist your tank. And you'll see that when I die here, because I spin around the VK with my ability, put a nice shot into him. I take one shot from the T. 25-2, and I do a lot of damage to that tier 8 heavy tank, which is all very nice. T32 coming around again. I bounce his shot into my track. Um, and there's that SU coming to roll around the corner at me. He decides to shoot someone else. I decide to therefore go around here. Now here's where I mess up. That VK had an ability there, which is where he can play dead. And basically the first shot that hits him won't do any damage. And I wasted my massive shot shooting at his corpse, which won't do any damage. He shoots the SU. I bounce the shot from the... Uh, T25, I put one more shot into the VK and bounce the shot from the VK as well. And uh, now I'm hoping that I can live, but that VK is going to reload far before I can. And there you go, I'm down. But as you can see, here's where those powers come in. As you can see, I have nearly, I have got nearly 600 of them. Um, and so I choose rapid fire to, re to reduce my reload time. And I also choose supernatural power too. There you go. Which increases my engine power. So look at me go! <laughs> this is without any sort of ability. Now I whiff the shot on the SU, but look at me go. I'm basically a light tank, but as a Tankenstein I do 500 average damage. <laughs> look at me go! And of course my reload time is only 13.8 seconds, so I have got a massive DPS monster. Look at that, 539 and I reload super quick. Look at me back off there. Super quick zap backwards. Um, and yeah, I'm nearly reloaded again. Ready to shoot that T32 some more. So, T32, not interested in shooting the AMX. He bounces off me. I put a shot, unfortunately damage his track. But it doesn't matter, I have a 13 second reload instead of a 16, nearly 17 second reload. So hey, yeah, could be worse. Tiger 2 comes around the corner. 
I decide to finish off the T32. And then the SU gets in the way. I should have shot at the I should have shot at the, the Tiger 2, to be honest. He was side on and I could have killed him. Um, well, possibly could have killed him on that low health. Unfortunately, though, they are capping the base. Someone has just shot one of them in the base cap, though. Tiger 2 coming around the corner. Unfortunately, don't get the shot in. Someone else puts a shot into him. There's that SU. Tiger 2, I'm hoping that he comes around the corner. But we are being capped, um, unfortunately. There's that T32 again. I'm aiming up, aiming up, aiming up, aiming up. Bang, shot straight into the side. And then the Tiger 2 decides to come around just when I've shot, so yeah. But we have managed to decap the base. We are winning as well. Um, in comes that Tiger 2. I put a shot right into his side. Nearly kill him, but didn't quite because I still had regular AP load, I think. Um, and so, yeah, we are winning 9-4. Everyone has three lives, as you can see. So the battle started out at, I think, 25 lives or 27 lives. There's that VK. Can't penetrate his front, but look at me go. I, I distract him. <laughs> However, he's not dead, um, which is interesting. However, it does mean I get to use my shot and I put it into his track, which is, you know, just brilliant, isn't it? Now, he did damage my, my engine, but he misses as I drive off and then I die. Yeah, unfortunate. Um, so, yeah, I now have a choice of what to do, but ah, there's only three of them left, so I can use basically my nearly 700 of them, uh, 700 ability shots, and I go for last grasp, which, you know, uh, I go for last grasp and uh, wolf shot, whatever that is. Um, I didn't quite read those abilities there, but basically, yeah. I can just roll up now and just sort of shoot at everyone. There's that Tiger 2, don't have shots on. He's one of three tanks left, one of two tanks left now. Just him. And the T-32 left. We're happy days. I can shoot at pretty much either one of them. In comes that Tiger 2. And I can basically roll around the side. Someone shoots me. Hits me with that chain lightning uh, ability. But I can now basically roll around. Someone nukes that guy from orbit. I put a nice shot into the Tiger 2. Someone else can finish him off. There he goes. Just the T-32. And I, I have health to spare. I can basically just roll around backwards like this. Because, well, you know, I'm fast enough, I'm going like 30, even backwards. So, yeah, I can sort of do whatever. In comes that guy. Ability. No, I decide not to use it. He tries to nuke me. He does, but he destroys my track at the same time. So, yeah. T32 now, still trying to take pot shots at me. And I can pretty much just roll up to his face. I'm going to shoot him. I'm going to spin him around. Last use of my ability, actually. Nuke him with mass damage, and there you go. Didn't even need to ram him off to finish him. So, yeah. That was a pretty fun game with 6,100 damage done. Um, a load of XP. I was top of the team by nearly 2,000 damage. I think, actually, yeah, by nearly 2,000 damage, I was top of the team. In a Tier 8 battle as well. Something to note. Um, T32 was top of their team, as you can see, with nearly 6,000 damage. So, yeah. But, I mean, <laughs> well... It's a pretty crazy game mode. I mean, 18 shots fired, 17 hits, 17 pen. Most of that was done with regular premium uh, with premium rounds. And even so, I still made nearly, you know, 100,000 credits income. Um, even without premium account, which I got for, for free, I think, from completing missions and stuff. Um, <clears throat> even without premium round, I still had 47,000 um, as an income. So, win-win either way. I do mass damage. Everything's fun. I roll around like I'm a light tank in a Tankenstein. It's great fun. If only they had that in regular game. Um, so yeah, I did kill... How many tanks did I kill? Three? Four? Four. I killed four tanks. I think I killed this guy twice in the T-32. Um, and then, of course, I killed the M41 once. And I killed this guy once as well. So yeah, whoopee days. But yeah, that was the uh, special event game. Uh, game I can't remember what it's called I don't know if it's still around is it I don't think so the chat no it hasn't the uh, garage has changed but yeah so that was it in the uh, in the Tankenstein where is it my my best buddy here it is with times 5 XP so yeah um, that was the special event uh, I'll thank you all for watching and goodbye